Hey guys, welcome back. Thank you so much for joining us. My name is Nick. This is my mom, Jen. Hi guys. And today we are watching The Fugitive. Yeah, I, I never did see this one. Harrison yeah, never Ford, seen it either. Tommy Lee. And the only, the only thing I know is just the one line I've heard. You know, Tommy Lee at one point says, you know, we need to search every outhouse, hen house, and shit house in a 10 mile area oh, or okay. something. Okay. I don't really know, like, the. The Context crime, or, the fugitive part, yeah. I, I just know that they're in the movie, and mm -hmm. it's like a well-regarded Harrison Ford story. And I think know. I heard something about a one-armed man or something. Yeah, I, I remember in uh, The Mask, Jim Carrey made a joke about, mm. or like his character made a joke about that, so. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, but it's just, just like a, okay. you know, good, you know, like, Brilliant. talk about, like, A-list actors and yes. leads, you know. Yeah, and what to, year is this one? Uh, I want Must to be ninety. I want to say it was like in the nineties. Let's see, nineteen ninety three. Okay. Yeah, I always have a kind of special fondness for movies from that era in the eighties. Yeah. It, fe it feels just like comfortable, like coming home. You yes, know? absolutely. Just like the yeah. just the way they look, the way they feel. Yeah. But uh, yeah, from what we've heard, this is a just a really well done mm -hmm. movie with some good stars in it. So let's check it out. Sometimes you can tell by the casting. Oh, see the Ward. See the Ward. Yeah. Cool. Oh. Oh, that's her. No. Oh. Something's happening to her. Julianne Moore. She's incredible. Ooh. Joe Padigliano. We, we just, just saw her in Goonies recently. <laughs> oh. Is that Sailor Ward? I, I think so. Hmm. Hard to tell. Well, she's not going to have a very big part. Yeah. That's like Bridget Moynihan and John Wick. Just yeah. like one or two little video moments. And... Yeah. Oh. There he is. Okay. So he's her husband. Or... Got scratches on his neck. Yeah. And blood on him, but that could be just from, you know, he holding her, her body he, or... Yeah. Okay. Oh, look at him with a beard, eh? Yeah. Remember Kara? It's funny, I, I usually just see him with a beard when he's, like, not, like, filming anything. Right, Like, yeah. at award shows or... Yeah. There uh, she, is. she is. yeah. Before I forget. Here, thanks for the loaner. Yeah, she's definitely one of those women that just looks stunning at any yeah, age. Yeah, she is, yeah. Oh, wait up. Oh, last thing she said to him. Well, maybe, yeah. People come to the door, trades people. I thought I know. Not that guy. And his fight with this guy with the one arm. Oh. Ah. Right on. Was it one of those with the, the hooks or? You mean a prosthetic? Yeah. It's not quite a gimmick, but. There's fingerprints all over the lamp, the gun, and the bullets. And the good doctor's skin is under her fingernails. But it's it's all his stuff. Yeah. And, you know, it's probably one of those where, like, there's no evidence that any, anyone else was there, and it all happens to point to him, or... Yeah. Who's the beneficiary? Well, husband, usually. Yeah. I am. The sole beneficiary? Yes. As she is mine. Like... Uh, yeah. Financially, you're not going to be hurting you after this then, are you? Oh, my God. What the hell? I mean, she was worth quite a bit of money. Are you suggesting that I... Yeah, they just, he just realized. Oh, Jesus. What, what do you weigh? God! What color was his hair? What color were his eyes? Yeah, I was recording all this when I was fighting him, yeah. you know. Book him. Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, you will hear... Oh, wouldn't that be awful? But... It's just like Andy Dufresne and Shawshank. Yeah, yeah. All the evidence pointed to him, but yeah. he didn't do it, you know? And also, like, who would have motive to kill, like, the wife of a doctor? Yeah. Like, did... Yeah. I don't know. Did he, like, fail to save a patient and this person's, like, family is after him or yeah. something? Because otherwise, if it was just a break-in for money, you would just... Yeah. Whatever, would, but... Yeah. He's not here still in the house. Did I hear you right? Oh, that'd be awful. Yes. Richard! Oh. Ma'am? Richard. Well, she was calling out She's to him, or him. thinking She's of him, trying like. To kill me. Oh Jesus. Okay. Yeah. It's a judgment of this court that you be remanded to Illinois State Penitentiary at Menard, where you will await execution by. Uh. Well, it's called fugitive. So yeah. He must get away. You'd think, but just for like a regular guy to escape from, you know. How do you get out all of here? Of yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, and they wouldn't, you know, they wouldn't even be looking for anybody else, or they think still they, investigating, or, they, oh my god. Yep, yeah, they think they found their guy. Oh, 
oh, okay, maybe on the way or something, something's going to happen. I'm wondering if or... either an accident or someone else escapes. Someone else he, is, he yeah. takes advantage of it. Just because yeah. at no point is he like a master criminal or has he learned, no, you know, right? to... Yeah. He swallowed something. Yeah. Like a... Yeah. That's yeah, a classic trick. There we go. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, I'm going to shiv. Yeah. Air. Oh. 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 Jesus. Got him. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Oh! Oh, good job. Ah. Oh, jeez. Oh, damn. That changed real quick. Oh, my God. Yeah, Ugh. they're not seatbelted in. Ugh. <laughs> Hang in there, you're gonna be okay. Oh, there's the key. Yeah. Oh no, they're not on a train track, are they? Oh shit. They are. Oh my god. Ah. Oh, that is a terrible position to be in. Come on, give me a hand with your van. What? You're leaving your friend? <laughs> just... Yeah. He actually saves them or helps, tries to help. Yeah. Ooh. Jump. Oh. Jesus. Ah. Oh. <laughs> wow. Wow. Oh, man. And there wasn't CG here, right? In, like in these movies, was there? There'd maybe be some, I guess. Maybe. I think the shot where he jumped, there might have been a bit. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Oh, and he's tied together. <gasps> the train derailed. Oh, my God. God damn. Lumber and, and well, fuel. Well, it just keeps going, right? The, yeah, these. What do they call that perpetual motion or whatever? No, or, oh, I mean, yeah, just freight trains are so yeah. long that. Oh, okay. Huh. Grab on, man. Is this him or is it the other That's guy? The other guy, I think. The other prisoner. Yeah. Oh, well, he got. Hey, Copeland. Be good. <laughs> like, okay, let's figure out what to do now. And there's nobody there to tell what happened, unless one of those cops is still alive, right? Oh. There's Joe Pantaleon. Oh, here we go, Tommy, Tommy. Lee. Yeah. <laughs> okay. A hundred yards, Sam? Yeah. Well, you gotta get some new boots. I told you not to wear the heels. I want you to wear two coats. Whoa, next oh, her? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know how. Uh, it's still kind of hazy, but somehow I grabbed him and, and I pushed him out of the bus. What a liar. I mean, Sheriff, I'm Deputy United States Marshal Samuel Gerard. I'd like to talk uh, to you. I'll be with you in just a minute. Oh. Dude, he's a federal agent. You're just a local sheriff. Yeah. Oh, wow. Gee whiz. Look here. Immediately disproving his. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Who the hell the keys, sir? Me. Where are those keys at? I don't know. Care to revise your statement, sir? Mm <laughs> hmm. So not even, he's just assumed that other guy died? That other prisoner? I guess so. And he's the only one on the run here? What I want out of each and every one of you is a hard target search of every gas station, residence, warehouse, farmhouse, hill Oh, house, here's the line. The dog house. Uh, he didn't say shithouse, so he said out. I guess so, I think I, I heard. I thought I'd heard that too over the years. It's Dr. Richard Kimball. <laughs> oh go God. get him. And away we go. <laughs> He needs to change his looks too, hey? Yeah. Shave. Oh. That's the reason why you grow a beard. So when you shave it off, you look <laughs> completely different. Newman? Yes, sir. What are you doing? I'm thinking. Well, think me up a cup of coffee and a chocolate donut with some of those little sprinkles on top. <laughs> oh. oh, the other guard, maybe. Yeah. And he'll be able to back up that, you know. Yeah, that it was Kimball that helped him, not the other cop. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is him. All right. All right. Watch your step there. Get that ambulance down here. Come on. Poor guy. Yeah. Stabbed and then, you know, in a crash and yeah. thrown over a hill. Yeah, he's a doctor, so he could maybe do it himself, right? He just needs the supplies. Mm-hmm. Oh, just carry something in like you work there. Yeah. Yeah. See, we'd be lost, but he knows exactly what he needs. Yeah, I mean... The... I'd just be like a Band-Aid. Well, the, the extent of, like... My knowledge watching movies, yeah. it's like if if you're in a pinch, like super glue, or oh, yeah. or else just like Stapler. you know disinfect with alcohol. Yeah. And then, oh, ah, oh. 
and then just oh, you know stitch it up or like staple it that'd be yeah i would almost prefer that i don't think i could like sew myself with a needle no oh. looks like a real beard eh mm -hmm. and the music stays high the whole time right then. yeah because at any moment if he's found you know yeah. there's, there's danger that's right Ooh. oh yeah, but he looks like a doctor. Yeah, well, and also no beard. We're looking for a prisoner from that bus train wreck a couple hours ago. Might be hurt. Uh, what does he look like? 61180, brown hair, brown... Uh, beard. Knox. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Oh, thanks, man. <laughs> this guy's gonna be such a fool. Yeah. Yep. Oh, yeah. Oh. Tell the attending he's got a puncture in the epigastric area. How the hell could he tell that? Looking... <laughs> there we go. I actually saved him. But whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Lots of friends, doctors, hospital staff. Okay, we're going to start right there. I want phone taps. We're going to start with his lawyer first. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're never going to get that. You call Judge Rubin. You tell him I want a whole bunch of phone taps. Why are you and I'll me? call him up later what? and tell him on who if I'm in a good Why mood. Why you yell at her? <laughs> <laughs> the wounded guard swears he saw Kimball right outside the emergency room. Well, that's hot. And an ambulance is missing. Where the hell's he going in an ambulance? <laughs> <laughs> oh, how can there still be a train coming through? <laughs> yeah. Is it gonna drive right on through? Yep. Lights and sirens. <laughs> Which no one would really question. No. If an no, ambulance, you, you know, charges through. Heading North State Highway 53. Running out of luck. The movie has a really good energy right now. Yeah, like oh it, yeah. It's carrying us through and very mm -hmm. thrilling. And but I'm mad. I don't think he, he didn't do it. No, definitely. The soundtrack is also really good. Oh, look at this. Oh, jeez. <laughs> and he might wouldn't know the roads here, maybe, right? Yeah. Oh, who the hell? Whoa. Oh, shit. <laughs> Turn around. Is there like a maintenance door, like somewhere oh, else he can yeah, go? Oh, yeah, right. Yeah, maybe. Like service tunnel or? You're right. There must be some sort of a maintenance thing here. Here we go. He's oh. down there. I got nothing. What do you got? You gotta be kidding me. What? You gotta be kidding me! <laughs> oh, you did get away. Yeah. Oh, flashbacks of it. Yep, definitely an escapable sized tunnel. <laughs> yeah. Oh, God. Oh. Go, turn, turn, turn. Oh. I got it. Face to face. Yeah, and the other guys all went the other way. Mm-hmm. I didn't kill my wife! I don't care! Oh, jeez. Oh, <laughs> You're just so committed to your job that, like, yeah. he's a prisoner, you know? Yeah, that's that's what it is, right? Regardless of what he did, or... They've been to I mean, he, and he's been found guilty, so it's uh, not like... Oops, got the second one. Yeah. Usually they pull that out of their sock or their... Yeah. That's just what they would expect you to do. Yeah. <laughs> but he's probably pissed that he let a prisoner get his gun. Yep. You gotta go, right? Yeah. Out to the river or whatever. Oh my god, oh my god. <gasps> I don't know if I could make myself do it, but... Damn. Okay, well... You know that feeling you get sometimes when you're standing in a high place? Sudden urge to jump? I don't have it. Oh. I think you do it just because what's your alternative? Your life is over, you know? Yeah. He's going to jump. Yep. Talking himself into it. Yep. Oh. <laughs> that perspective. Oh, God. Whoa. He'd be lucky not to die, right? Okay, if that wasn't a dummy they used, yeah. props to Infinity for whatever stuntman did that. It's like in Goldeneye, remember Pierce Brosnan jumped off that dam? Yes. What happened? Where'd he go? Go get a Peter Pan right here off of this dam, right here. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Gotta run all the way out, try and yeah. get down to the... Oh, they're stuck in there. Like, if you think about it, right, as an innocent person, what would you do? Uh, yeah, like I mean, anything you could. But like, you know, he almost got shot, right? 
Yeah. One person in a million can survive that fall. The guy is fish food. Okay, get a cane pole. Go catch a fish and ate him. <laughs> yeah, so far I'm I'm really enjoying Tommy Lee. Like his he feels almost like like a cowboy, but very yeah. like not as say like you know gung ho mm. break the rules, but just and very... that they're one of these groups that just moves in, right, and pushes the rest out and gets things done. And... Yeah, I, I like their like they're very snappy like yeah. banter and you know. Yeah. It's a fun antagonist for, for our hero oh, to... Oh, yeah. I think I'll rest for a while. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Covered with leaves. Try and stay warm. Yeah, think back to happier times and... Yeah. Well, it would be horrifying to be somebody that you deeply loved and, you know, respected and would never, ever hurt. Everyone... This is what happened, see? Yeah. Everyone thinks that you killed her, you know? Yeah. And, of course, you're covered with... But he was downstairs. Oh, I see. He said he fought with him. There's. Yeah. To everything from me. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. Prosthetic, yeah. We can't find the guy. And how did he get in? And. Yeah. There's no evidence of a break in. You find that man. Oh, he's going to go find him now. Might as well. Yeah, you know? what the hell? Whose wallet is that? Uh, oh, that just that guy who, like, his hospital oh, room. Oh, right. Did? Yes, right. Whoa. Oh, that's neat. Going into the tunnel. Yeah. Would you know how to color your hair? <laughs> just apply everything the, the, until the, the color the box, changes? Yeah, the box will tell you. Yeah, a certain amount of time to leave it on and all that. Yeah. Well, it's like uh, Marie and Jason Bourne. Remember, yeah. they cut her hair, darkened it, and... All right, Sammy, we got you. Shacked up with some babe over in Whiting. She left work tonight and took him home. What? Hmm. Like, are they talking about the woman that just picked him up? Yeah, or? how would they know? Yeah. Uh, uh. Be drunk, man. Yeah. Be drunk. <laughs> Newman, I don't want you to get lost in here. You stay with me. Right. Yeah, I don't think they have this right, do they? No. Oh, this is... Oh, this will be um, the, the other guy. Oh, the other guy. Away. Okay. There we go. <laughs> Come on. Oh, no. Man. Oh, shit. Uh-oh. <laughs> well, he just walked right in, too. He didn't look. He didn't... He seems the most, like... Yeah. Like the newbie the of new the group, guy, you know? Yeah. Well, he said to him, stay close to me. Tell you what I want! I just want a car, man! Oh! <laughs> Damn. That was a hell of a shot. <laughs> He's so pissed at him, eh? Yeah. Yeah, you don't... Yeah. I don't... Bark it. <laughs> yeah, he's just like a... Like a hound. Like, once he gets the scent, he never stops the hunt, you know? Yeah. Why did you run? Running only makes you look guilty. I wasn't worried about appearances, Walter. Tell me where you are, so I can come meet you in. The guy's phone tapped. Yeah. St. Louis. So he showed up not dead yet. Let that be a lesson to you boys and girls. Don't ever argue with the big dog. Big dog is always right. <laughs> <laughs> it's also the rule, like in, in movies, unless you see a body, yes. they're not dead. That's right. You know? I might be crazy, but that train sounds like an L. St. Hey, Louis doesn't have an elevated train. I lived under an L for 20 years. That bell, that bell is the bell on the Well Street Bridge. It's six blocks away. I knew that was an elevated train. Oh, yeah, big... Hi, <laughs> Billy. How's it going, sir? Oh, this guy. Oh, that's his friend, isn't it? I think so. Yeah. Up yeah. in the back seat or something? Something, yeah. I'll just jump up and like, ah, yeah! <laughs> uh, he will. No, I... D <gasps> Ooh. Oh, my God, Richard! How are you, Charlie? Oh, yeah. yeah, just like he's a window washer guy. Yeah. Yeah, be like, holy shit. He did it for the money. What do you mean he did it for the money? He's a doctor. He's already mm -hmm. rich. Yeah. She was more rich. Well, like, he loved her. Yeah. <laughs> oh, room for rent here. Yeah. Oh, God. You will have warm. <laughs> Dr. Vinkman, why are you came? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, off the grid, just paying them cash. Mm hmm. How the hell is he going to find out who did it? Yeah, how do you, why? like... Why? Ryan, how did they get in? And... How do you track down clues? How do you... Yeah. 
and she was upstairs so i'm thinking she didn't open the door and let him in and she had all she had the rose petals out yeah for him, so she wouldn't have come back downstairs no so he got in somehow and like no signs of forced entry so like somehow did he enter the house earlier and then just kind of did that just thing where he hid in the there, closet maybe all yeah. day you know and yeah. then just yeah oh maybe he's gonna try and find out because the guy has one arm right ah uh, prosthetics try and find there out. you go yeah you get scrubs and stuff dr clothes well this is where like all the maintenance, oh, maintenance guys are the, i guess yeah you know, right the okay yes be. you're right all together yes we did oh i found them already while well, they're doing everybody i guess they're interviewing everybody yeah when did you see him last oh richard yeah okay i saw richard this morning what? You saw him this morning? He stopped me in my car. I gave him some money. Yeah, it'd be worse for him if he yeah. withheld that. Yeah. So just... Richard is innocent. Yeah. And you'll no, that's never good. find him. He's too smart. Is he as smart as you are? Smarter. Oh, oh for like an ID for badge. For the ID badge, yeah. First of all, I want you to know oh. that I believe Richard Kimball. Hey, Jane Lynch. Would yeah. he come to you for help? If he came to me, I would help him. So he, he was there when she came home then, maybe. I'm thinking. Oh, that guy. Yeah. We've seen him. He's always a... He was a, one of those executive decision... Or, oh. Yeah. Right, he was the, the guy they were trying to get out of jail or something. He was also in a Patrick Swayze movie yeah. called Next of Kin. He was like a mob boss. Ah. Uh-oh. Oh! Oh no. They found him? Uh... Shit. Whoa! Already? Oh no, where are you gonna go? Grab your stuff. Yeah. Shit, shit. Or someone else in the in the one of the upper floors. Maybe. Some other like drug buster. What's the sun or something? Yeah, yeah, okay. it's someone else. Uh oh. Oh yeah, there's the sun. Yep. Right! Yeah, it's holy shit! Totally unrelated. Don't I yeah. <laughs> The police only knew who was downstairs, eh? <laughs> wow. Like, I shit my pants. Whew. Like the mother of all coincidences. That... Yeah, so he's got to have a... <laughs> Damn. Yeah, it's a pretty thrilling plot so far, yes. you know? Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, something happened. Maybe like a school bus. Oh, oh big bus, bus crash. Yeah. Oh. When the hell is Julianne Moore going to show up? Yeah, you're right. We're like halfway through the movie. And yeah. <laughs> no sign of her. Yeah, and she wasn't like a doctor friend or... Yeah. And it's a one-armed man, not a woman, that yeah, killed his wife. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> See, the average layperson wouldn't be able to do all this because they wouldn't know the medical stuff and the... Oh, yeah. Yeah, print. Yeah, make it look like you turn the blinds because you're cleaning them all. Mm hmm. Quick, put that away. What time did he arrive at the house? About 10 30 in the morning. Oh. Uh. And he was alone? Yeah, he was alone. So they do know. Well, I guess, like, after they arrested him, he. Uh, Kid, you mean to tell me that this is the guy staying in your mother's basement? That's what I'm telling you. You'd be desperate to, like, lessen your sentence, or so it's like, hey, you know, I think this guy with, you Yeah. Know, oh, just a bunch of kids. Yeah. I just saw her. Julianne Moore, so she's a doctor. Yep. There she is, yeah. Yep. Right here. Oh, he'll be able to help, right? Because he's a doctor. Yeah. But he can't just do that. Yeah, no. no oh, damn, he doesn't know that they're... Yeah. You can see one side's all red, isn't it? Yeah. Al, what's the status on that kid? Possible fracture sternum. He's stable. Al, get over here. He's stable. <gasps> okay, at least he can have a look at him and yeah. You know, he, like puncture a lung or yeah, she's gonna see that. Oh. He's gonna have to do like a what do you call that? Put in there through their lung to get him to breathe. Or yeah, like. Aspiration or yeah, oh, aspirate him. Or yeah, yeah. So he'll change what's needed to be done with him yeah. instead of observation. Yeah. It'll be he's supposed to go into surgery. Mm-hmm. Hey, doctor. 
Uh, they sent this one off from downstairs. Yeah. Bob, get this one in the room for us, Dad. Good. Bye-bye, Joel. Oh. Hmm. But now all hell's gonna descend on this hospital here in a minute. Uh. She's gonna see him. And... Hey. Uh. That's bullshit. Who changed those orders? I don't know what you mean. You stand right there. <gasps> oh. Shit. Run! Run! <laughs> oh, there they are. But he saved his life. Yep. How's the boy doing? He saved his life. That tells you a lot right there that he stopped to do that. Yeah. He's Mother Therese. Excuse me. Yeah, sorry. Ah, the one arm thing. They just got it. Yep. Yeah. Hello. Yes. Um, this is Dr. Elway at Cook County Hospital. I'm doing follow up work for the project. Uh, yeah. Matthew Zellick. We did. I'm terribly sorry. Oh, he passed away. Oh, jeez. Uh, Cross him off the list. Yep. Uh, Clive is on our list of uh, missing in action. Um, no kidding. Armed robbery. Uh, uh, Damn. Robert, cross check these people for criminal records. I remember. It's green. St. Patty's Day. Uh, <laughs> oh, right, because the one guy was in for robbery, uh, right? Yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> stare at him long enough. Yep. Yeah. Oh, geez, here they are, right? Yeah. Why can't they die of blue the other 364 days of the year? Pigs, do I know? <laughs> do I know? He just has to see him to know, right? Yeah. I'm going to assume not. See, it feels early just to... Yeah. Oh, they're me. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's not him. No. He'll say there was a mistake yeah. or... Yeah. Listen, pal, I wish I could, but I can't. I'm sorry. They just got him here. It's like, what? <laughs> bring him back. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's weird, you know. Yeah, to do that, right? Like, what? You come all the way here and it's a mistake. Yeah. You don't. Yeah. You know, people don't do yeah, that. So. No. Oh God, my stomach's all butterflies. Yep. Oh. Oh, he's on the other <laughs> side. Oh God! Oh God! Oh God! Oh. Trip him! Trip him! He'll lose him in the crowd or yeah, whatever. Yeah. Roger. Oh shit! Oh, don't look up. Uh, ah. Run! 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 Luckily, you've got a head start. Hop over the railing to the next landing there. They do that all the time. That's what I would do. Yeah. Make a hole. Yeah. <laughs> Coming through. Officer, there's a man in a blue top coat waving a gun and screaming. And a woman. Oh, good job, oh. man. <laughs> nice. Dive, dive, dive. Oh, my God. Just take it with you. And get through, get through, get through. Oh, oh, bulletproof glass. Oh, oh. No, 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 turn your foot. Turn your foot. Get it. Uh, turn. Just get through. There we go. That's a courthouse. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Open the blast doors. Open the blast doors. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> there we go. So, uh, cold, just like yeah. Take off that green coat. Oh, it's perfect. Blend in. Ah, uh, so oh, true. Yeah. <laughs> He's probably going to be so pissed. He was eye to eye with him a couple times, right? Yeah. Turn back straight. Look back. He's right up there. Mm. Oh, yeah. Taking the coat off. Give it to somebody else. Uh oh. Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, Harold Christ, what <laughs> a fucking rubber crutch. <laughs> What year was this again? Like, we're in the... His, 90, 93. His, his film chronology, where... Uh, well, I mean, Indiana Jones was the 80s, so... Oh, right. And then as was Star Wars, so... Right, okay, so it's after. Is this the house? Isn't this the one he was calling? Like, this is maybe uh, the guy, right? I think so, yeah. Oh, maybe that... Because he they would have had the same list, right? Yes. Remember, they just had more names on it? Yeah. Ah, uh, oh! He's a cop! Oh! Right? Chicago Police Department. Okay. Holy shit. But again, what's the motive? Yeah, what's the motive? Who's that? We've seen him. Yeah. We saw him at the... 
at the party. Yeah. Richard Kimball. Oh. Sport fishing, <laughs> pina coladas. Yeah. What does the hospital have to buy? What's the catch? Sailfish. <laughs> no, there's no strings attached. It's probably some phony thing, right? Yeah. Okay. So he was coming there to. Probasic. Drug of the future, boys. Clean up those arteries. Put us out of business. Oh, uh, new new drug. So did this guy, like his kid or his nephew, die because of some, something like he endorsed? Yeah, this is Gerard. Do you remember what I told you in the tunnel? We ought to oh. be sipping some whiskey. <laughs> <laughs> you uh, said something like, um, you didn't kill your wife. Remember what you told me? I remember you were pointing my gun at me. Because you were pointing your gun at me. Yeah. Well, I am trying to solve a puzzle. Five seconds location. And I just found a big piece. Richard. Oh, they'll come there and find it all. Yeah. There you go. He left it open, yeah. Mm-hmm. There he is. Mm-hmm. Yeah, okay. I got it. The doctor who killed his wife, right? Kept blaming somebody for it. Somebody with a... The hand looks so weird, eh? Yeah. It's coming after me? Does he have a reason to come after you? Well, hell yes. I have a prosthetic arm. I must have murdered his wife, right? <laughs> I wasn't in Chicago on that night. I was on a business trip. Fifteen people verified it. What line of business mm. are you in, Mr. Sykes? Security. Who do you they said he had a good system. If he worked for that same company. Pharmaceutical company. Yeah. There, there it you is. Go. Cancun, Mexico. It was a junket that the company paid for for some doctors. Kimball go with you? You don't see him in the pictures, do you? <laughs> I'm so sorry, Doctor. They said it was he knows. Can I help him? I mean, by finding out about this other guy. Yeah. Devil and McGregor and Lentz. Lentz was supervising the protocol for our DU90. He knew I found out it was causing liver damage. It was. Okay. He knows too. Does he know too? Dead. What? Ooh. How? He died in a car accident last summer. Uh huh. Accident. You think he knows? You think he's? I'm wondering. Did he go on that trip? Because he's one of the only other like prominent figures they keep showing. Yeah. I told you you wouldn't find Richard. Has he been to see you? No. That's the truth. Yeah. <laughs> now, Devin McGregor did seven and one half billion dollars net sales wow. last year alone. Mm-hmm. But. You know, and stuff like insulin these days is, you know, they charge uh, yeah. through the nose for it. And... 17430. 17430. You got it. Thanks, Bones. I'll make sure all this. I don't know. I'm suspicious about his friend. Yeah. Just in this whole part. Maybe he didn't know, think he'd ever figure it out. See you. Good mm -hmm. to see you. Say, whatever happened to that thing with your wife? Oh. Oh. He doesn't know. Doesn't pay attention to it. It's getting very tense. It is. Well, it's been well, tense for <laughs> most of the movie. <laughs> oh, yeah, he needs her to analyze stuff. Mm hmm. What do you think? Cold no. Clearly not the same tissue. Oh, they swapped, they swapped it out. They swapped it out, yeah. They all came from the same liver. Oh, jeez. Oh, okay, that was sloppy. Yeah. You think Lenz is the bad guy? Half of the samples he approved were signed the day he died. Oh. Someone else must have been manipulating this. Yeah. Someone with access. It's his friend, I think. It's Nichols. Oh no. He's thinking too. Yeah. Where are you going? Is he a friend? Oh, oh damn. Nichols, you bastard. Yeah. The release was approved by Dr. Charles Nichols. Nichols uh, also knew Lentz. Yeah. Whoa. Nichols screwed up by not saying he knew Lentz. Yeah. Lentz's boss. Yeah. I want you to make sure they turn that place inside out. You got it. Don't let them give you any shit about your ponytail either. I won't. Well done, young man. <laughs> <laughs> All he has to do is kill him and it stops, right? Yeah. I mean, there should be enough now with the marshals that they're like going it, on, but yeah. he's the only one that can identify him mm -hmm. in his house. Oh, God. You got no weapon or nothing.
No. Time for a rematch. Yeah. When I cross-checked Kimball's phone records, one came up. Kimball called Sykes. 7.30 p.m. from his car phone. Why would he have called Sykes? Yeah. Yeah, car phone. I mean, was he still at the function at 7.30? Yeah. Did she call? She wouldn't have called him. No, because she went home first, and then he came in much later. Yeah, and it's not to do with her. We know that now, right? It's, it's only to do with him and this study. So maybe the friend or someone else used his car phone to call Sykes just yeah. so they could place all the Here. blame on oh, him. What's on the paper? Oh. There you go. Oh. Say hi. I'm a twin. <laughs> yeah, he's gonna go get a. Oh shit! There's a cop car. right there. Yeah. Oh shit! And you can't just jump off the train. No. <gasps> oh. Shit. He doesn't know there's a cop right there. No. What the hell, eh? Oh, oh no, it's just a young cop that, oh god. <laughs> no one else, like, sitting right there sees him holding a gun. Oh. Oh. Aw, some poor cop. There you go. <laughs> well, and the people on the train can say that it wasn't him. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Get those Indiana Jones punches in. Careful. Oh. He's got one arm. Yeah. Get him. Yeah, keep... Yeah. Murdered my wife, you piece of shit. Now the gun has his fingerprints on it. I uh, yeah. But everybody on there should have seen. Uh, that show you watch with Brick, the little kid, the dad's oh, tall. Yeah. yeah. Was that the dad? Oh baby. Wow. <laughs> Called the middle that show. Mm -hmm. Mr. Stop. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Get off my train. <laughs> Oh, here we go. Well, the driver's like, what's happening? Uh, Transit cops spotted Kimball on the L. He's headed toward Balbo. The CPD is on the way. Even though he's not the killer, we're still after him. And the other guys, yeah, at least yeah. he's tucked in there. But Transit police report officer down at Balbo Station. Kimball is suspect. Repeat, officer. Mm. Where are the people that were sitting in the car that could say what happened? They were reading a newspaper. Yeah. Apparently. Jesus, yeah. Dr. Charles Nichols. Also, he played uh, on Whoopi Goldberg, Jumpin' Jack Flash. All oh, right. Mr. Ben Meter. This is saying he entered a hotel from the subway. That's my man. Not anymore, he's not. He's going down. You want to help us? You... Oh, you shitheads. Yeah, those idiots. A new drug on the cusp of approval by the Food wow. and Drug Act. Uh... Provazic is remarkably effective and has no side effects whatsoever. It is also noteworthy that this drug... There you go. <laughs> yeah, every model. drug in existence has a side effect. Yeah, yeah. You know. And what we hope will be the model for continued dishonest... But the thing is, when they release these he's drugs... A, he's a dishonest... Yeah. Ah, Freudian slip. You switch the samples after Lentz died. Get off me. The spotlight's right on yeah. them. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, shit. Never get Jeez. Right, you never give up. I fucking took my life from me. Yep. No, don't. Oh. Oh. Come on. Yeah. There we go. There you go. Oh. <laughs> How's the view? No! <laughs> as soon as you get a clean shot, you take him out. These oh, assholes. Six. Well, and, and like the way they conducted the initial investigation, they were totally yeah. like, like uh, biased. Biased. Yeah. One suspect, so we'll just prove he did it, right? That oh. happens all around. Shit. God damn it. They're not calling it off. Oh. 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 Yeah. Punch him in the kidneys. <laughs> Ooh, there they go through the glass. Yeah. Yep. Oh. Yeah. Ooh. Ow. Oh, jeez. Damn. Oh no! It's on top of the elevator. Oh. I need medical help. And so does he. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Call an ambulance! Call an ambulance! But not for me. Is he in there? Hmm. Dr. Charles, or is he... 
Well, last time I saw he was wandering around. Yeah, but... There's no way out of here, Richard! Richard, I know you're innocent! Oh... Uh, okay. I know about Dr. Charles Nichols! Oh. Oh. Richard, he borrowed your car the night of your... Oh. No forced entry, Richard. That's he why. on Sykes from your car, Richard. Huh? He's gonna kill that cop. Oh, shit. Duck. Oh, no. Duck. 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 Oh, no. Oh. God damn it. He's gonna save him, I, I was just gonna say. From Nichols? Yep. Because he just said he knows everything now. Mm-hmm. Yep. <gasps> What a scumbag. He's gonna come up behind him here. <gasps> he almost shot you, man. Yep. Take me in. Like, I can't do this anymore. Check on your partner, too. Yeah. They killed my wife. I know it. Yeah. You? I know it. Hmm. You got a demo. I played a weather roller. Oh, yeah. Tell Samuel you're right. I'm going home now. I'm taking my vacation. Oh, <laughs> oh he's okay, though. Absolutely. <laughs> Man, was he drawn into a shit show, eh? Yep. Thought you didn't care. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell anybody, okay? I think they need a new speaker for the conference. <laughs> yeah. What a good show, though, eh? Oh, so oh good. Oh, my God. Julianne Moore, we saw her for like two minutes. Were, she was in here for so little. And they've got her so high on the... I know. Gas list there. Yeah, between her and C. The Ward, it's like the yeah. the casting department, they they comb through my list. Yeah, <laughs> like, yeah. <laughs> my laminated card. <laughs> yeah, right, yeah. Okay, The Fugitive. That was good. Like you said, it was thrilling. Yes. Like, through and through. Absolutely, right? From like because it, it's a different thing where we don't know. Is he innocent? We don't know. We knew from the beginning. Well, well yes. Uh, you know, as soon as he started to have memories, actual, that we could yeah. see of right. fighting with a one-armed guy. Mm -hmm. But yeah, usually it's, you know, you're not so much on their side if you don't know. And it's just, this one was right from the beginning. Just like, oh my God, they're just... Well, and it's... It, if you look at a movie like, let's say, uh, Silence of the, the Lambs, that's all about authorities investigating the crime, looking for the killer. Yeah. In this case, that was like half of it. The other half is the protagonist. We know he's innocent, the, yes. like the guy they suspect. Yeah. And he's trying to figure out what happened yeah. while he's being chased. Yeah. So it's just like, it's, from minute one, it's just and like... And they a, have such such far reach, right? It's like, okay, you go take over this, take over oh, that, we're yeah. taking over everything, and then... Yeah, exactly. well, and that's the thing with the marshals too, because like you know, people can like cross state lines, yeah. and you need to have authority yeah. to just do something like right now to because otherwise they could just escape. I mean, mm -hmm. look how easy it was, you know, just like one guy, other one other guy tried to escape, and then all hell broke loose. Yeah, and, yeah. But yeah, great performances. Like Tommy Lee was fantastic. Yeah, in this he one. was just at it the just, beginning. I don't care. It's like, well, I think I've heard that line too. Yeah. It's probably like iconic, but. Yeah. It, in a way, he was almost like a uh, Inspector Javert, you know, to to Kimball's Jean Valjean, you know, like I don't know who that is. Oh, it's from um, Les Mis. Oh, uh, but the idea is that you know the inspector or, or like the, the you know the authority, because the other person was imprisoned or was convicted, it doesn't matter the cir yes. circumstances. It doesn't matter. That's they are the part they, they're following. They are a criminal. You are, uh, yeah. even though in Maybe Valjean's he case, yeah. he he stole a loaf of bread to feed himself, yeah. and and like he oh, was like okay. he spent twenty years in prison oh, for it. God. Javert, it, it, from his perspective, it was just oh you're a criminal. I need to hunt you down. You're yeah. the scum yeah. of the earth. Yeah, that was like it was that's a whole what arc. Their job is here. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. So right. yeah. I kind of got the, those vibes here because he's mm -hmm. like I don't care. And it wasn't until like halfway or three quarters of the way through the movie that he actually started to look into the yeah, think, uh, yeah. that this guy might not be guilty. You well, know? and I understandably he it was because he 
figure it out that he would go all these places. Yes. Because he was trying to figure it out himself. So it's like, okay, then that's how we can catch him is by following along. And and, yeah. and if he, let's say he were guilty, he would just try and escape. He yeah. Try and get out, out yeah. of the country or yeah. do whatever. But yeah. because he, you know, it's like, why the hell would a guy who's being chased by federal marshals go to the courthouse to talk to a criminal? Like, yeah. you know, yeah. stuff like that. Yeah. Like, or to there, the hospital. And yeah. There has to be a reason. Yeah. 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 But then, the cast surgeons, both are actual doctors. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I imagine they had uh, you know, at least a couple. They're, they look like they were at a real hospital. So at least a couple of like consultants have, yeah. here, just so like when Harrison Ford was talking about like liver samples and everything, yeah. it all sounds yeah. legit. To... And the way they did with um, what's her name, the actress we just said wasn't in it very much. Oh, Julianne Moore. Yeah, I thought when she, he was interviewing her, or asking her questions mm-hmm. at the end, she's like, "I'm tired. I want to go." That somehow he would meet up with her outside, and she would say, "What's yeah. your deal?" And what. Well, you know. I, it's funny because uh, earlier I mentioned um, like like Marie and Jason Bourne like I thought she was going to be a similar role like the, he would kind of just run into her she would yeah. get roped into the, yeah, the case just, the whole thing. they had her like them. third or fourth uh, listed in the cast like yeah, you know yeah. more so than but, like you think she's going to have this huge role and yeah, she shows up for like five it, minutes yeah. <laughs> it's wonderful to see her obviously yes, but yeah, it's, added to the show and everything, uh, ultimately but... a very small role you could have had anyone in that part exactly which is kind of yeah. interesting yeah but but no, just you know, really really fun. You know, and the music was good. It the soundtrack was right? great. It was, it kept you kind of on the edge the whole time, even when he was doing stuff like making an making ID, the ID or, or that. They had phoning that music someone. Going. Yeah, yeah, just like from minute one. And and it's funny just because like you know Harrison Ford like you know cemented himself in pop culture as like one of the ultimate badasses. Mm-hmm. Like he was Han Solo and Indiana Jones, two of like the coolest characters to have yeah, ever lived. Ever. Yeah, and then you know even like Indiana Jones, like let's say he'll. And maybe stumble or, or there'll be like a jokey moment. He'll still like like punch or fight his mm-hmm. way through a situation. Mm-hmm. Here he's otherwise just a regular guy, but like he's yeah. he, I mean, like he's a doctor. He's obviously mentally yeah. like quite quite excellent. And and you know, they said he's like, you know, he's like Nickel said, he's smarter than me, you know, and, uh, yeah, and all that. Yeah. Like he was able to apply his smarts in an interesting way, but it's otherwise he's just like a, a an average guy who just happens to be in this this mm-hmm. adventure mm-hmm. and like when he fights he's very kind of chaotic and yeah. he's not a trained yeah, it's true, right? Like and like you know badass Very, that's a good point yeah true. so it, it's, if you it, just think of him well he's indie he's this or he's that he so it's a, it's, a, it, it's a bit of a pivot from like his his past roles yeah. like like indiana yeah. jones and star wars by this point were like say like 10 years old ish mm-hmm. from those roles and so he, yeah. you know and people people would like know him as, yeah. as those so yeah. it's just kind of fun to see him go through and yeah and then yeah and you know tommy lee he had he had great kind of banter with joe pentoliano and mm-hmm. and all the others it was it was honestly because like our focus is on Harrison Ford. Harrison Ford is like the biggest yeah. name. Him and Tommy Lee, like you know, people would mm-hmm. go to the movie to see them. Yeah, and so it's very easy for like the, all the other side characters to be like, "Oh, get out of the way! We want to see oh, the, yeah. the lead but actors." It was their but, group and everything, right? But there, yeah, the writing was really like yeah. well done. So that like, and then obviously the acting. It's like we we found like them entertaining too like with newman like he he he, he fucked up going to that yeah. one house and yeah. got himself almost killed. Yeah. but then he kind of stepped up later on, and then with you know Joe's character who we feared for his life and yeah and yeah just like a very like adrenaline you know pumping oh, adventure yeah. from yeah. like minute one there yeah. was like almost no time to rest yeah and i know there's another movie called u.s marshals with yes Tommy Lee, so i don't know it's the same character i guess or yeah you guys probably. can tell us should we we should do that one or mm-hmm. i met yeah one? just like a, you know the character was i guess popular enough that mm-hmm. he got a spinoff so probably just yeah. a different yeah different crime because yeah, really because be it you know it felt like like you know kimball escapes whatever we're meeting this group halfway like like let's say they've already had one movie where they all mm-hmm. met and they yeah. you know formed their bond and yeah. everything they're just kind of working them well together so yeah it'd be kind of fun to see them in another mm-hmm. another circumstance you if know. it's the same i wonder if it's the same group or yeah mm-hmm. but yeah that was the fugitive ladies and gents that that was a thrilling was ride good, yeah. from beginning to end yeah you know, similar to similar vibes to like Andy Andy Dufresne from Shawshank, and that mm-hmm. he was like wrongfully in prison for killing his wife. Mm-hmm. But then that one was more of like I say a slow burn or whatever. But also someone else did it, and it's like you know, in, in Shawshank, Elmo Blatt, you know, just says like you know, he laughing because it's like they, they pinned it on someone else yeah. when I did it. Yeah. So kind of you know similar vibes that way, but but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed as well. This was a lot of fun. Mm-hmm. So if you want to watch our, our full length reaction, I'll put a link down to our Patreon below. Check out this and all the other movies and shows that we do. A lot of exclusives mm. aren't on YouTube, so check yes. those out. If you enjoyed, please like and subscribe. It really helps us, helps the channel channel grow. And uh, yeah, that's all we have for you today. So we will see you later. Bye, guys. Bye.